Hello and welcome back to another episode of European Universalis 4. We are continuing our game with Nepal and I just saved and reload uh, because, well, I had a little bug going on. Uh, <laughs> and the, he actually crushes my vassals. Ah, that's hilarious. Uh, not, not, not a lot of fun, but, well, that's hilarious nonetheless. Delhi, you are recruiting troops, which is concerning. Let's see if they will actually go to where I told them to go. Indeed they will. Will you help him out? Ah, you jackass Punjab. Um, I'm a little bit concerned if they actually take the... the capital, I won't be able to vassalize them. I will be able to take their money, which is more or less what I want to do. But if I could vassalize Delhi, it would be a little bit better. Although that would probably break the alliance that I have going with these guys. Maybe. Alright, they flipped this one over to me, so that is something. Well, we'll see. We'll have to wait and see. Apparently, oh, I can barely flip this over to everyone. Interesting. It isn't... It shouldn't be like that. Yeah, just stay there, Gooj. Because these guys can kill you. And I'm not going to ever accept their demands, so... Oh well. 172! A whopping 172. Jeez. 3, 4... Yeah, these guys are already tech 4. Bengal, do you have ideas yet? No, you don't. <sighs> I'll have to wait and see what type of ideas will I take first. For starters, I would love religious ideas, but... Uh, maybe not. Just maybe. The first idea group is kind of important. Trade is off the... L I don't have anywhere to send actually my traders to. At least not right now. If I had started on these trade nodes, I would be rich. Baman is a pr uh, mo most of all. Ugh. Vulcan hand. I need to start to see what alliances Janpur has. Bengal, Baman is... Oh, crap. Really? Baman is in Janpur. Well, ain't, ain't that fun. Don't go there. You're going to fight against them, and that's no good. Can I call you in? No. Jean Burondelli. Yep, I thought that would happen. So, uh, vassalization is off the limit right about now. Because I cannot fight Jean Pur. I definitely can't. I'll take their money, though. All their money. Yeah, good supplies, that's brilliant. Especially considering that I'm not using any ships. Repay the loan. One seventy five. Jeez. I'm almost tempted to just <laughs> do this one, but for a zero point ten ducats, yeah. Better not. See what they what these guys will actually do to this one. Not that it matters though, but oh well. Might actually take upper dog. Ooh, 120 golds. Yes, please. Oh yeah, this will be great. Yeah, I knew that Delhi was rich. I didn't know how much, but. Oh, they actually flipped this over to me. Right, so 84. Oh, more cash. Brilliant. Um, I think this is it. Yeah. Done. Punjan, 
has announced John Poore as her new rival. Good. Let's score it straight away. Let's actually increase the autonomy a little bit. <laughs> because, well, I need it. And let's repay the most loans that I can. 2.47, and I still have 22 loans. I owe about 331 gold, which is good, right? Yutsang no longer a valid rival for Nepal. Well, that's no good. Oh, jeez. Reduce, reduce, twice. Ugh. Might actually go for economic ideas to start off. Alright. Jaanpur, Oris, and Punjab. Well, if that's the case, Jaanpur it is. Occupied by Jaanpur. Yep. No desired provinces, no desired provinces. Okay, that's something. Gain mercantilism. That's always nice. Good supplies has expired. Yeah, we got mercantilism out of that event. Out of the five years event. 0 0.2, that's not too bad. I could bump up the stability, but that's not. Seven base stacks, jeez. 39.77. That's the best province that I own, right about now. If I hadn't taken these two, that would be almost as as much as all of these put together. Okay. Bengal, Shanpur, and Delhi, they rivaled me all. Sure. Uh, fight Yutsang. Lost a claim on... Oh, crap. I need to vassalize these guys. It'll be another buffer. Uh, let's fabricate another claim and we'll see what I can do with this. This time around, these guys should actually help. Of course, repay all loans. Repay. Ah, oh, so good. I'm now making a little bit more of money. That's so good. 21 loans. September. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to repay that one yet, but... It's in it's improving at the very least. Bamanis and Jampur, yeah. The fact that you are allied with Jampur and Bamanis doesn't really help me. Really not at all. If I could get an alliance with Aithaya maybe or something along those lines. Yeah, these guys took ideas defensive. Ideas first. Yes, yes, I know. Oh, right. Integrate these guys. I have no diplomats to send, right. Integrate. It's It will be one more uh, unit, basically. Although, one base stacks, but... Well, it beats anything. Right now, base stacks is awesome. Let's repay my... Inflation 1.48, okay. We are making 2.42 gold per month. Oh, lovely. Still haven't gotten any event there. Which is surprising. Core construction is being done. So that's good. 1480. Yeah, you need to actually siege Sindh. Where is Sind? Is Sind gone? Sind is gone. No, you're still... There they are. Integrating goods. Well, at the very least I got one unit. Sure. That's fine. Could recruit a leader, not going to do that. At least not yet. National Epic expired. Okay. 148. Conquest against Yutsang. Ale de Mongyang. Which is there. If I were to declare war on you, only a son would join. Not Punjab. And not Gondwana. So that's a little bit tricky, actually. 
only have 2,000 men. And they with these guys, well, 4,000. And these guys, 8,000. Versus 3. And what's the army of Mongyang? 7,000. What kind of nonsense is this? Okay, so no, you are definitely not going to fight uh, Yutsang right about now. Indeed, we are not. Love to take that province, though. Yeah, but both Jeonpur and Bamanis will join in. And Punjab would not. So if I had to guess over here, yeah, Gondwana would not join. I need to see if I can get the alliance with Orisa back as well. There we go. I know I'm paying diplomatic cupkeep, but I feel much more secure with having this set of alliances. What I wouldn't give for a gold province right about now. Baman is on Vigi. Okay, that's good. No, Orisa, I'm not going to marry you. Repay, and I can only re repay one. Ugh. 2.12. Well, that is something. Let's start to move you guys there. Ladakh, you're a vassal of the Timmies, if I had to guess. Yep. Yep. Is a vassal of the Timmies. Multan is a vassal of the Timmies. That would be a crazy good alliance if I could pull that off. Yeah, no. Nope. You would definitely know. Vigi. Nope. Oh well. Need to see what I can do with this though. 12 gold. 12 ducats. When will this one expire? 81, so it's about to expire, okay. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. No, you're actually fighting Vigi. Sure, give them support. 62, 27. Bamanis would, is about to leave, though. Gondwana, you're already at war with Bengal. You're allied with Vigi. You allied Jeonpur as well. Yep, this is... An annoying set of alliances, by the way. These guys always do, always do this. Which is annoying, because their army... These, these are one of the biggest nations that exist in India. And they th their tendency to, uh, to ally each other. Although it makes sense, because they are all Sunni-based religions. These guys are Shia, Sunni, Sunni, if I had to guess. I do believe so. And Shia, yep. Although it's annoying, it makes sense, but damn, it's really annoying. Because Vigi cannot sustain this, and they rival Dorissa. One of the reasons why we cannot ally them is that. So yeah, all things considered, we are in a precarious situation. Really, really bad situation. Pull off an alliance with Ming, maybe. Ally with Yanjo. Or something along those lines. Start to give me cash, please. And Envy has now accepted. Brilliant. Start to give me more cash then. More cash. Yeah, 2.68. Oh, it's per year, but still. Right, I need to integrate these guys soon, if I can. Need to see if I can vassalize these guys. Minus 34. It's mostly due to uh, military power. If I were to bump up my army, we should be able to pull that off. However, I need to first repay all my loans. Which is not a great um, LP so far, but we need to do what we need to do. We still have a lot of time before Europeans arrive. Sure, some. I'll royal marriage you. Start to prep you for the uh, 
vassalization. You are a five base stacks. Alright, we are making gold now. A little bit. Not too much, but a little bit. Oman with a uh, nudged. Really? Go nudged? Oh, they allied Yemen, if I had to guess. Adal, Varzangali, and Baluchistan. Actually, they didn't ally Baluchistan. In Varzangali. And Adal. Adal, Varzangali, and this one. Yemen allied. And just. Nope, they didn't. Hajran and Baluchistan. Repay. Another one. Orison Vigi. Will you call me to arms? See, this is one of the worst things they could do. If they allied each other and went to town on Bamanis, because they are the same religion, by the way. They are both Hindu. But of course, they try to kill off uh, each other, and Bamanis swoops in and takes the, the prize, basically. It's annoying as hell, but... Grand Captain, Land Maintenance Modifier. I would love to try to get something out of that, but... Three gold? Three gold! Jeez. We are making th three ducats each month now. Oh, we are making money. Fifteen... <laughs> Fifteen uh, loans yet to repay. But it's getting close. Lost the claim on Bahrain. Yeah, I was expecting that. Rest assured, I was expecting that. Oh, someone is already level 5 there. Oh, jeez. Might actually go for economic. Straight away. Economic straight away. Uh, do, 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 do. Economic or... I need something that will give me money. Trade is also a, a thing, but trade won't come into play until a little while longer. So I do believe economic is the way to go right now. We are making what? Two golds from taxation and 1.50 something. Oh, crap. Oh well. Repay the loan. Another one. 3.04. <coughs> ah, sorry about that. I suddenly had to sneeze. Need 8.38 to actually pull that. Okay. Eight hundred and ten. No, definitely not going to pump up stability. At least the Tibetan Patriots uh, actually, because they cannot fight me, we have a turret right here. If they actually try to fight me, they'll have to fight these guys as well. So, although it's annoying to have rebels popping up everywhere, but oh well. Two point ninety four, or three point fifteen. Two ninety-five. Okay. Gujarat on Baklana. These guys are Sunni as well, by the way, or Shia. Yep, Shia. The fact that Simmons actually have provinces here is kind of annoying. All right, eight thirty-eight. Let's stack up and let's start to take economic tax modifier, build cost, inflation reduction, interest, advisors, maintenance production and inflation also this one with hang on I can show you this one with quality ideas gives 5% more discipline so yeah economic we'll start with economic and we start off our country a master recruiter national manpower modifier I would love that I'd love to get advisors but I need my army up to force limit soon 11 yeah it will mostly be infantry, by the way. <laughs> Throw infantry at it. We'll probably put about two or three cavalry, but the rest will be just infantry. Infantry heavy. Repay another loan. 
12 loans. Okay, it's getting close. If I were to declare war on you, Bengal, would they still join in? Yeah, they would. 46, 29. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. This is all about monies, by the way, which is annoying. <sighs> Three golds array. Two more months we'll be able to repay another one. Some. I'm improving relations with you. Yeah, as soon as I can get the um, military power, we will be able to pull that off. Thankfully, we'll be able to vassalize these guys. Then I can actually fight these guys and actually give them over to them or take them for myself. All that nice stuff. They're allied with Karchar and Sadia. I lost my general. Which is fine. Karchar. No idea. We can look though. Yeah, with these two. Okay. Yes, I do know that I have that. Uh, it's not great you actually moving over to here, you know. You're actually fighting against Ava, Arakam and Kam. Ava, Arakam, and Kam. Okay. Sure, let's take this one up. Dock and marketplaces. We cannot build one and the other because loans. 11 loans still to repay. No. I'm not going to, put, to do that to you. If you would accept my alliance, I would, but you do not. So. Huh, Gondwana, you were broken like crazy. Now you will not accept vassalization still. Why? Nepalese military power. Okay. Nope. No royal marriage, please. Thank you. Look at Pamanis go. They actually border me now. Ugh. Ugly. Please tell me you had Gondwana as a rival. No, you have Nepal. Brilliant. Punjab, brilliant. Orissa, Gujarat, and Viji. Fight Gujarat, god damn it. And you. Nepal, Ava, and Orissa. Ava, I do believe it would be in our best interest if you were actually allied me. Huh, no, he actually is content on going back and forth here. Okay. Oh, repay another loan. Ten loans. Okay. I'm actually going to put a cut. Not the most interest in <laughs> of LP right about now. But we do need to do this. Uh, it's a shame that we need to. But we need to start off our country. Uh, that war really drove us into bankruptcy. And I'm foreseeing another one uh, soon. With that intent, uh, you will definitely not, because you're not a same religious group, so yeah. I uh, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, please make sure to leave a like, and until next time, do take care, and goodbye.